pulmonary fibrosis is the worst. And I just wanted to be 100% real with you guys today. This is one of my least favorite diseases because pulmonary fibrosis is the worst. It just has a horrible prognosis and eventually their bodies just do not utilize oxygen anymore and they pass away. Pulmonary fibrosis has many different types where sometimes it's more aggressive than others, but this disease typically will take someone's life unless they have other life-limiting illnesses. So what happens with pulmonary fibrosis is essentially in the lungs, scar tissue builds up. It gets so inflamed and irritated that scar tissue literally builds up inside of the lungs. And when that scar tissue builds up, it creates a network that oxygen cannot get through. So what happens is someone might start on two liters of oxygen and then they need six liters of oxygen to really try to push through that, that scar tissue. And then normal nasal cannula oxygen that's just a, a little bit of a flow doesn't work because there's no pressure to get it through that scar tissue. So then what happens is they end up on pressurized oxygen meaning like high flow nasal cannula that's high pressured or CPAP or BiPAP with a mask that literally pushes the oxygen in and pushes it through that scar tissue so that the body can utilize it. Now what happens eventually is even with pressurized oxygen, it doesn't get through. And without oxygen, there is no living. There is no life. Without oxygen, the lungs stop working, the brain stops working, the heart stops working, we die. This is a heavy one and I've had a lot of it recently and I just felt the need to kind of throw it out there that if you are struggling with pulmonary fibrosis or you have a family member that's struggling with pulmonary fibrosis, please, for God's sake, talk to each other and tell each other what you wouldn't want because if you do not want to be on a ventilator, please write that down. If you do not even want to be on high flow nasal cannula or BiPAP or CPAP, please write that down and tell your family members because if that's not a life you want to live, then don't do it because for you in those situations, it is going to be a form of life support.